Last week we checked out the latest evolution of the People Mover as designed by Mitsubishi, a stylish yet practical unit called the Grandis. Well this week another slightly different interpretation of the People Mover from Mitsubishi, but one that's proving to be very popular among growing families for two very important reasons, a competitive price tag and versatility. Back in 1989, Mitsubishi Japan took their Star Wagon People Mover and added four-wheel drive running gear. This concept was so popular, it was carried through to this body shape and named the Delica Space Gear. Truth be told, Mitsubishi couldn't have picked a more appropriate name because there are just acres of space for all your gear in this cavernous cabin. With a choice of seven or eight seat configurations, there's plenty of room for passengers and what's more, everyone travels in deluxe comfort. Well, there's something to be said for the space gear approach to luxury. I mean, these seats are just so comfy. I'd recommend this is the ideal tour bus for a band. And talk about controlling the world at your fingertips. That control panel up there has all manner of gadgets and gizmos, from uh, controlling the rear aircon to the sunshades. So the space gear is the limousine of people movers, but does it have the grits to go off road? Well, the whole box and dice sits on the chassis and running gear from Mitsubishi's Triton, a ute renowned as a tough four-wheel drive. That means it gets the dual range gearbox and the ground clearance, making the space gear perfect for carting the whole family to a secluded beach or a camping spot in the bush. But with the luxury comes the inevitable weight gain, with the fully optioned version tipping the scales at around 2,000 kilos. It's also taller than most purpose-built four-wheel drives, so tackling extreme terrain and very steep gradients might prove a little challenging for the space gear. As well as the space gear's versatility as an individual unit, Mitsubishi also demonstrates its versatile range of options by offering a number of different wheelbase and engine combinations. Hey, you even have a choice between a low or a high roof. The space gear the lads and I have been cruising around in is powered by a 2.8 litre turbo diesel. With plenty of torque down low to churn your way slowly through boggy terrain, this one's a great option if you're heading off-road on a regular basis. If city driving's more your agenda, then there are a couple of petrol engines available, an economical 2.4 litre four-cylinder, or if you're aiming to fill every seat with passengers, you'll appreciate the bigger, more powerful 3 litre V6. Now these low kilometre space gears aren't brand new, but what that does mean is a very reasonable outlay if you're sticking to a budget. As they were produced between 1994 and 2002, you won't find them in your local Mitsubishi showroom. Dealers who do stock them are likely to specialise in Japanese imports, such as the dealership that loaned us our drive car today, autowholesale.com.au.